Katie Price's mansion renovation is in full swing. Since starting, she's completed eight-year-old Jet's jungle bedroom. In addition, all the dark wooden beams that run throughout the house have been shot blasted back to the original wood. You wouldn't think this is the same house already, would you? No. No, seriously. When you stand here, and if you think all the walls are going to be like white, house. it looks warm. This hallway's going to look the nuts. Katie's kitchen had almost been completely destroyed by vandals. After weeks of repairs, the walls are now replastered, the floor replaced, and the cabinets are starting to be built. This oh, look. Much better. Oh my god. How good does it look? Inside the house, Steve is overseeing the next stage of the kitchen construction. The kitchen's taking a massive leap forward with the worktops, so even though I've got more to do, more doors to put on, it does look remarkably more finished than it ever has done. And it's just a narrow amount of pulling my finger out my bum and finishing it. Look at this room, how big it now looks. Inside the mansion, the kitchen is now ready to be styled. How the floor is now all flush. So I've added this kitchen in. This is one of the main rooms because it's a family room. Doesn't matter what house you go in, you always end up in someone's kitchen. Doesn't matter how big or small it is, you always cram up in the kitchen. So that's why I put that island in. I've decided to put the table here. I want it quite minimal in here. When I say minimal, obviously I'm going to put my bits and bobs about but just so it just feels big and clean and not so much cluttered. But there's nothing else to do in it now but fill it. You want to get the sofa in first then? Yeah. Start with that. So yep. if you bring sofa, I'll bring pillows. Yep, OK. Brilliant. Yep. Here we go. Dogs, if you wee in it, I would go nuts. I don't think so, buds. Buddy, get out of there. Get off my sofa. Get off, they know. How dare they wreck my sofa. And this is the cushions that I made. Remember? They're all coming into handy. But how good is this? 15 foot, this sofa. It wouldn't fit in many houses. It just goes to show how nice and big this space is to be able to have a big sofa that we can all fit on. But look, as you can see, it's starting to come together. Now, how cool is this light? I mean, come on. Now, this looks like I'm going fishing, but trust me, it will look good in here. I know where I'm placing it. If you go tight, it's facing the wrong way. Could be quirky. Or... What do you think? I, do you know what? I don't want it normal. Let's do quirky. Yep. Yeah. I think it looks more fun like that. <laughs> this come from Harvey's house, and this was in his kitchen. But I thought I could put all my condiments, like seasoning stuff and that in it. But it looks too white on white, and I've got to have a little bit of pink. So I think it might look good if I just paint the edge pink, because it will go pew, on the white, the heart. It's all about the love. Bringing back the love into the family home. See, look, that looks pretty cool. See, it's things like this that just change things. I think this paint dries pretty quick. I just want to get it on the wall and fill these bits up. I've done the heart, it's on the wall, and it's nice that when I stand here in the kitchen, there's pink there and there's pink here. It's a showpiece, but at the same time, there's stuff in here that I will actually use. I'm into all my little pots and stuff at the moment. It's like Kate's Cafe for myself. After months of hard work, Katie's kitchen is finally finished. So the more the more I'm doing this house, I realise there's more things I need, and I definitely need fire utensils. But I absolutely love having a fire. I can't believe I've been doing this room all day, that it's actually dark outside and getting late. 
Well, that's what it takes, determination to get this room done. So I think we've finally done it, Steve. After being burgled and ransacked by vandals, Katie had all but given up on her kitchen. Now, new life has been breathed into the space, giving her home a heart again. I love what you just walk in here and it's just clean, open. It is very cosy and homely. What I like best, it's now a family room with a nice working proper kitchen where it's sociable. I'm just loving it. It's colourful, bright, and it's better than anything I've ever done in here before. It actually feels like a home now. I've got the dogs, I've got Buddy just making himself comfy on the sofa, blade on the floor, the fire's going. It's my happy home. I'm loving it. <laughs>